The project was established in 2023 and focuses on poultry, aquaculture and crop farming. Due to limited resources, they are now only focused on aquaculture, farming catfish and the construction of their fish ponds began in June this year. Despite facing some challenges, project founder Sofia Emiljo says their fish farming initiative is making steady progress. The main pond now holds a carrying capacity of over 1,000 catfish, providing both employment and relish to the local community. At the moment, I really like what's happening here because um, the community members, we have employed three youth so far that come and assist with everyday um, practices since we take, we use the water from the pond to, to the garden, which is still being established. However, we, we, we use the, the water from the pond to the garden and uh, the, for this we have employed people that come and assist with that. And uh, it has also provided quite affordable catfish to the local people and uh, yes, so basically it provides jobs and also affordable food to the people. Agricultural science teacher Johannes Mbulu from Oshawa Pala Combined School in Onga Circuit brought his learners to witness the harvest. Anyway, I will just come, I just come here with my learner from grade nine to witness the harvest and the initiative from the young entrepreneur who is trying to inspire and motivate our young ones. At every time, even supposed to have at least an idea or knowledge on how to produce their own food. For us, as a country, or as a community of uh, Endora constituents, to be food self sufficient and food self uh, independent. Grade 9 agriculture learner Kamati Sirka said they came to learn more about fish farming as part of the agriculture lessons. We are here to see how fish are being, how fish are being farmed and we are here to, to ask how we can keep those fishes and to ask what kind of food they can keep because we have been taught that in agriculture. Uh, yeah, fish farming. The Sosarina Sustainable Farming Project continues to promote food security, youth empowerment and sustainable agriculture in rural communities across the Angwena region.